last week in an exclusive investigation for this program, fox's hillary vaughn showed how the t s a. allowed a major security loophole to exist at our nation's airports every day across the country, food catering trucks enter and leave airports without facing proper security screening it's an obvious problem, one that could be exploited by terrorists. now we're happy to report that our investigation apparently had an effect hillary vaughn joins us tonight. hey hillary Hey, Tucker, we just learned the TSA sent out an internal memo this week following our report exposing the food truck loophole, telling its TSA inspectors changes need to be made to the food truck screening process. Last week, we gave you a trove of internal TSA documents that show catering trucks roll through our airport gates unchecked by TSA. Instead, they farm out security to airlines who pay private contractors and trust them to stop explosives from ending up airborne in catering carts. But our investigation turned up TSA internal audits that prove these private contractors repeatedly failed to follow protocol. In 2018, the TSA audited Flying Foods Catering Company that serves planes at JFK Airport. 95% of the airline security contractors failed to check the cargo correctly. It's security theater. We're spending all this manpower and hours uh, patting down children, elderly, veterans in wheelchairs, but the airport workers who have, who could be motivated by greed can smuggle whatever it needs past security. In the new memo, the TSA recommends something new, that searches now include TSA employees and not just airline workers and their paid contractors. Two TSA whistleblowers tell us that this is in direct response to the national security threat that we exposed. Uh, the part of the what they said includes a pullout uh, that says discussions of possible remedies and suggestions for changes to these security programs are related to catering and supplies. This TSA document says that TSA inspectors around the country need to come up with changes to their catering security program. The TSA told me tonight they discovered these issues as part of a special emphasis assessment, giving us this statement saying in part, quote, as with each special emphasis assessment, a working group convenes to discuss potential enhancements to policy, security measures, training, and procedures as a result of the assessment's findings. Tucker, we obtained this special assessment, and it shows Food is not the only thing going on board unchecked. Truckloads of ice, magazines, blankets were being delivered to the cabin of the aircraft without being searched or screened. Tucker? That's shocking, actually, that's been going on uh, all these years since 9-11. Hillary, thank a lot. thanks a lot for that report. Appreciate it.